putting on a night of comedy and mind reading. That's right. We are joined by mentalist phenomenal Phil Rosso this morning to tell us all about his upcoming show. Good morning, Phil. How you doing? Thank you, Matt. Thank you, Kyrie. Thank you so much for having sure. me here. It's yes. super fun. Glad to have you back again yeah. in studio. <laughs> so first, before we get to what we're doing today, how does it feel to be back in Peoria performing locally? It is so great to be back performing locally. I, I will say it's fun. I used to do Zoom shows for a while, and, and <laughs> that's just not very right. fun, right? To nope. be in my basement studio doing that. So we're going to be live on stage actually this weekend with two shows. So Friday night is my good friend Terry Growie. He's a hypno humorist. Wow. So he's a fantastic comedy hypnotist. Yeah. So if you've ever never been hypnotized, yes, done come the, on ooh, out. You that. have. Oh, that would yes. be fun. Come on stage and be the star of the show. And then I'm going to open for him. And Saturday night, I will be on stage doing my full mentalism show that I don't normally do for the public. I normally do it for corporate audiences, but I love Peoria, so we're going to do it this weekend before Thanksgiving. Yeah. We'll have some fun doing some mind games. Oh, very nice. And when, <laughs> when can people catch these shows? We That's want people to come out and support. Yeah. Friday and Saturday night at the Broadway Lounge. You can go to phenomenalphil.com and get some tickets uh -huh. and uh, come play some mind games with us. And Good. Speaking of games, I yes. was playing Yahtzee the other day. Have okay. you played Yahtzee? Yes. Uh, on Yahtzee, you've got a little dice, okay. right? Yes. So what I'd like you to do is just take the die and roll. Let's make sure it's not one of those tricky dice, right? So you roll the two, go ahead and roll it again. Okay. Oh, a six. Okay, so there's different six different sides on a dice. Right. This time we're going to test your intuitive abilities. Oh. So take the die, put it in the cup, shake it up, and then put it upside down so you don't know, Matt doesn't know, and even I don't know, and no one knows what it's going to be. Okay. Okay. All right. Excellent. So you put, you did it. Did you think about what you did, or did you just do that yourself? No, I kind of had a little, you know, I wanted to. Ah, yeah. Mm, well, we're going to test our intuitive abilities okay. with these little cool rock star yeah. uh, music band vintage posters. They're so cool. I picked, up, picked them up at a thrift store the other day. Nice. I picked up six of them. Okay. One, two, three. Four, five, six, and Matt, you said you're not a, probably a big fan, but everybody loves music. I right? know all these bands, and, no problem there. And these are cool. I mean, they're postcards. You could wow. mail them, but I brought them just to show you what my favorite all time band is of all time. Okay. Oh. In fact, Kyrian, she knows. You know. Because she I used know. her intuitive abilities. We had one, two, three, four, five, six choices of bands. You roll the die. Uh huh. I can prove. Which one of these is my favorite band? Take off the top and let's see what number you rolled. One. A one. A one. The Beatles. The Beatles is, a matter of fact, my favorite band. Wow. Really? Why are you they You want me favorite? to prove it? Yeah, I want yeah. you to prove it. Because this morning, when I got dressed, Don't do it, Phil. I put on <laughs> my Beatles oh, my. t shirt. <laughs> there we wow. go. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Boom. He knew. He wasn't, okay, no, I was gonna say, how's he gonna prove it? You knew. I knew, and I it's had no clue that I knew. It's been a hard day's night putting on my shirt, so, so wow. great. Very cool, it's that extra step. That's what got me, Phil. That's what got me. I didn't me. know how he was gonna prove it, I'm yeah. like. I don't, you gotta prove it, we gotta see we the evidence. How are we gonna do this? Love the Beatles. This is the kind of crazy mind reading stuff you'll yeah. see Friday and Saturday night at the Broadway Lounge. Cool. Say, yeah, a couple hours ago, <laughs> Phil got us twice yeah. today. <laughs> twice, he's been spot on. Right, very good. Phil, thank you so much for joining us. So great. Break a leg this weekend. It's always good to have you on. Thank yes. you very much. And we will share all of this information on our website, ciproud.com. We'll be right back.